Ah, it's a nice morning this morning. Um, uh, I've been having a little bit of problems with this uh, left hand brake. Um, strange, but um, I managed to uh, make up a little jig and um, laid the lever flat so I could take the top of the reservoir off, um, topped it up and pumped it obviously with the uh, calipers forced open and burped it as it says as it's recommended and uh, I did that for five minutes and uh, topped the reservoir back up and put the cap back in and the top of the reservoir back in and it's made a hell of a difference <laughs> It's as good as the other side now, so there must have been a little bit of air in one of the pipes, but I uh, just bled it out. I didn't need to bleed it, just burp it out. Um, but it's still making a hell of a noise. It's um, screaming as the brake's gone. So then I decided to have a look at the rotor, the disc itself. And it's in fact the wrong way around. So I'm going to take it off and put it on put it back on again and see if that makes a difference with the noise. When I say it's on the wrong way round, I don't know if you can see the little arrow. That is the uh, rotation it's supposed to go in, but this one is the uh, left hand side, so if you can imagine it's going like that, it's actually going the wrong way. So, <laughs> so basically, if I put it on that way round, then it will be correct and we'll see if it stops the noise. That's the uh, rotor on the right way round and we'll see what the brake's like. But if someone had told me that putting the uh, rotor on the, right, <laughs> the wrong way round would make that much difference I was amazed. Um, yeah, noise is gone. <laughs> the braking's the same but the actual juddering and the noise is gone so um, yeah, it seems to have made a nice difference. Um, going back to the actual uh, lever, like I said, I didn't bleed it. I burped the air out of it like it says on the uh, YouTube, which was extremely good. Worked very well. Got a really nice present um, from a really nice guy in America from a St. Louis MO. Um, he sent me a really nice pair of um, rims with brake drums in them. Um, amazed. Um, he wouldn't take anything for them either. I'm really appreciative, appreciative. You know, it's really nice of him <laughs> to send them all the way over here like that. So Jim, um, Mr. Jim Hook, Mr. Jim, um, if you ever want anything from me, mate, let me know. And he even sent me the um, cut the brake levers and everything, they're in the bottom, fantastic. Um, I'm going to see how the hydraulics work out, on, uh, which I've just fixed, um, and we'll see how, how that works out. Um, if they work out okay then um, I won't put them on, but what I will do with these, I'm, I was going to put these on the um, work bike because they do a bit troublesome, I use them every I use it every day and they do seem to gum up quite fast, I'm always cleaning them out and so I thought well it's only going backwards and forwards to work so I'll probably put the brake drums on that. Yeah, I was gonna go for a ride but uh, rain has stopped play so it looks like uh, it could be a ride tomorrow. Or if it stops may get out for an hour later on, don't know, see.